Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. It's our great honor to have Professor Sergei uh, Vazazar coming from uh, Moscow State University. Um, Professor Vazazar, would you mind say hello to the audience? Good evening, everyone, the audience, dear me, and nice to meet you all. Uh, thank you, Professor Vazazar. Uh, Professor Vazadeh is the key organizer of this magnificent conference called uh, 2015 International Congress on Heterocyclic Chemistry called 2015, dedicated to the 100 years anniversary of Professor Alex Coast, who will be ho he was host uh, this week, and it was a great success. And I just wonder, uh, Professor Vazadeh, <coughs> you are the opinion leader and the expert in the heterocyclic chemistry. Would you mind sharing us? Uh, the highlights and introduce about the, this uh, Professor Kost and the conference. Yes, sure. Uh, Professor Kost was an outstanding chemist or in the chemistry of uh, heterocyclic compounds and uh, he was the creator and head of laboratory of biology collective by uh, heterocyclic mm -hmm. compounds. Uh, the very known the uh, regiment of Kost in the uh, chemistry of heterocyclic compounds, or the uh, opening and closing the heterocyclic rings. And uh, he also was a very, very nice person, very good friend. He, he helped a lot of young scientists. So he was really an outstanding person. So that's why we're celebrating his 100 years anniversary with this, this big Congress. And we heard this conference have over participants from 20 countries, over 500 publications, and also include young scientists sections. So uh, we also aware you are the fellow of Royal Society Comes to UK. It's a very uh, astonishing achievement. So would you mind share your learning process and how you like to encourage the young generation how to develop their career and how to set up their uh, milestone for learning chemistry? Um, I think it's very important to, to teach our young chemists and at Moscow State University we have different levels and different programs for doing that. Mm -hmm. uh, starting from lectures and seminars, the uh, personal work of students and their own reports. And uh, for example, uh, concerning this Congress, uh, most of our postgraduates were obliged and they with, with, uh, happy came to the Congress and they attend the lectures, listen to lectures and even ask questions. So this program of Congress was very important for educational uh, item of our uh, for our young uh, students and uh, PhD students, and also they attend the special uh, young uh, scientist conferences, and they uh, enter the competitions. They get get some uh, uh, prizes and uh, awards. Uh, we also noticed in this conference, the Russian scientists stand a very important role on it, in each session. So I wonder, would, how would you position the Russian scientists to distinguish yourself from the uh, uh, American or Western or other Asian scientists? Uh, Russian chemical science uh, has a very, very big tradition, a very, very deep roots. Yeah. And uh, it was uh, yeah, continued to develop independently for some time in 19th century and even in 20th century during the Soviet Union epoch. And uh, yes, I think we have a lot of brilliant minds, men and women also. So, uh, and maybe one of the problems of Russian science to represent itself to the world community is the uh, problem of uh, Russian journals in Russian language and the uh, low possibility to, to publish in a uh, higher rank uh, Western or Eastern journals in English. But however, in this time we find a, a great improvement for the English and the science advancement and we very, very much appreciate for uh, you organizing this conference and we hope next year you will invite us back for your conference and then we will have the opportunity to invite you to share your essence, your advancement and your intelligence on your science and development in uh, heterocyclic chemistry. Thank you, Professor Vassata. Thank you, thank, thank you, you, thank you. Thank you.